Hey people, what's up? It's Jamil. And I just want to talk about some more glory I've been getting out of the gang stalking program. Now recently I've been working out a little bit, um, you know, in my backyard. And I realized that a lot of the, uh, the children in the area often come out and study me while I work out. And I thought to myself, you know what? To a child, when somebody's an adult, they look more powerful than as they would to another adult. You know, a child, children naturally look up to adults. And I thought to myself, you know what? This is an opportunity, you know, this is giving me motivation to keep keep up with it, not do the things I said I wasn't going to do. Now, I already quit smoking and drinking all that stuff, but I said there's no way, there's no way I can do something like that now, now that children are looking up to me. And I noticed it. I'll be back there, like, lifting weights and stuff. I noticed the children will just be sitting there, like, focusing on me and staring at me and stuff. And I've almost sort of, like, turned into, like, a role model. It's, it's like, you know, I've almost turned into sort of, like, a, a you know, a more powerful figure. And as the only person in the world that beat gang stalking, <laughs> Now people are looking at me. Now when I go to my email box, I get emails from people in England. I get emails from people in France. I get emails from people in Africa. I get emails from people in China. People email me, not just asking me about conspiracy stuff, but asking me about what am I talking about the gang stalking. People who never heard of it are curious about it. And then I've been talking to people on the telephone. I've been helping people grind through their issues by teaching them to change their experience of gang stalking. And at first, you know, it was interesting to connect with people. Then I realized how now, now how much now how much of a uh, a role model type figure I am. I mean, these are people who are literally on their last leg. One guy is like literally on his last leg, and he's counting. I mean, to help him grind through the gang stalking, and I'm, and I'm doing it. I'm not doing it from a perspective as I have all the answers. I have all the power. I'm trying to let him know he has all the power, and all I can do is teach him about my experience and how every day I took the, I took it one step further, one step further, one step further. Um, everything the gang stalking program has done in my life has only made me 110% better. I actually kind of laugh to myself because now it seems like the gang stalking program has like ran out of gas, so to speak. Like a lot of stuff they do, pretty much everything they do, it's almost like they're just guarding leftovers. It's like <laughs> Jamil's at the back door with candy bars and, and, and bottles of soda pop and, uh, you know, VCRs and Nintendos and stuff. And I, I'm, at, I'm at the back door like, yeah, you you know, you can have that piece by. And I'm like, out of there, you know what I mean? I've gained my spirituality. I'm gaining my physical health increasingly. I'm, I'm gaining, you know, psychologically, I'm becoming stronger and stronger and stronger. And I owe it all to the gang stalking program. So when you're going through the gang stalking program, anything that you felt that was like, <sighs> um, anything that you felt that was frustrating or whatever, realize to be to shine like a diamond, you have to be cut like a diamond. And I just say to myself, I call it the gang stalking program. So I just say, charge it to the program. <laughs> charge it to the program. If you feel, you know, if something happened, if somebody cuts you off or something like that, you're driving your car and you're being gang stalked, charge it to the program. Whatever it is, charge it to the program. You know, I know 110% no matter what, each and every day I'm going to become more and more successful. And eventually I'm going to live the life I want to live. And I owe it all to the gang stalking program. And so I, I just go from there. And as the only person in the world so far to beat gang stalking, I let people know I beat it by changing my experience of it. It's made my life better no matter what. No matter what. If I had not entered the gang stalk, first of all, i got to thank the secret societies. Because ha had I not done my conspiracy research and gone through all my quarrels with them and ended up in the gang stalking program, my life wouldn't be what it is now. All that happened for a reason. Everything I went through in the last four years, everything I went through... Do, doing my conspiracy and looking into it, it's all added up to this moment now, and it's all made me 110% better no matter what. You know, every single thing was used to improve my life. And so I just, you know, I have to be thankful. It's like, it, okay, a lot of times people look at it as, the, as, as when they go through gang cycle, like they fail this, they fail that. You will fail your way to success. Literally, you will fail your way to success. Every single successful person out there has a failure story, whether it be Michael Jordan who, who would, didn't make the ninth grade basketball team, and he was told he'd never be a good player. Um, there's a lot of stories. I mean, Bruce Lee, he was told, Bruce Lee was actually told he would never make anything of himself because he was Chinese. And at that time, you know, in the, in the, in the early, early 60s, Hollywood was much different. And so Bruce Lee had to go to Hong Kong to make a film, and then the people in Hollywood seen how what, he had something, so they called him back, and then the legend was born. I mean, people fail their way to success, literally. And so whoever you are, whatever you're going through, even if you're not being gang stalked and you're really striving on something and you, and you need some inspiration, like, hey, Jamil, I saw your video. I really don't know what gang stalking is, but I can tell you're really getting something out of it. 
I have this situation. Can you talk to me about it? I'll be right there 110% no matter what. And so that's where I'm at right now, man. I'm just, I'm just connecting with people, building that circle of success. A lot of people contact me and they want to grind through gang stalking. They might not be given it 110% at first, but pretty soon they will be. And so you just create a, you know, a circle of success around you and you just keep the ball rolling like that. And so, you know, I, I can't say it any way better, man. I mean, just, you know, I mean, conspiracy, for some people, it, for some people, it, it's sports. For some people, some people go to the military. Some people, you know, go to college, whatever, whatever it is. For me, it was just conspiracy research. And, and I made a success through that, through the gang, I got into the gang stalking. And now I got people contacting me, like literally people are watching me from all over the world now. And so it's pretty cool. You know, it's like, it's like I'm, I'm moving up. And, you know, I got to be thankful to the gang stalking program. As crazy as it sounds, I, I got to be thankful. Charge it to the program. <laughs> <laughs>